information from Okada-san. Very valuable. I also learned something through my own efforts. We must meet. Where will it be this time? Trash processing plant? Deserted end cart station? In the south of Japan town, there is a street market. It is on the footbridge above the main street. Use the elevators. It is easy to get lost. I am on my way there. Do not make me wait. Hey, Judy, what's up? V, hey, can you come over, Stat? Something happened? Yeah. Just come. A Ken Tao AV has crashed outside of Night City. The aircraft thrusters were deactivated by sudden EMP discharge from a nearby damaged power station in Santa Domingo. The emergency landing attempt proved unsuccessful. The passengers who survived the crash. I do not understand. Does Arasaka not have enough of its own people? Look around, sir. Things are heating up in the city. Hate to interrupt, but... Oh, perfect timing. Why? What are we doing here? You shall learn soon. I acquired some information of my own. Do you know who most wish to honor Arasaka-sama with the parade? His murderer. The irony makes me sick. Yorinobu's a smart little muffin. Putting on the parade to show off his attachment to Arasaka, its values, and to solidify his legitimacy. He is true. I will not deny that. Japanese heritage is one element. Yorinobu will also put on a display of power. The floats are sure to be beautiful, but the wise and I will see in them a hidden message to his foes. What message would that be? I am here, Gumin Domo. Watch your backs. Not one for subtlety, is he? Still don't see how this gets us anywhere. I have had an idea. Look to the sky. The dash floats will pass precisely this way. If I could just get onto Hanako-sama's float, I could speak with her in private. Get there how? Why jump? 
Of course. Expectations way too high, Goro. Couldn't pull that off even if you still had your fancy implants. I have thought of a solution. While you are occupied with your shady dealings, I learned more about the floats. They are all kept in one place, Arasaka Industrial Park. It is there that they prepare them. We need only to break into the compound, find the right float and inject a virus into its system. You will then be able to disable any security before I sneak inside. Lots of ways to skin this particular cat, you know. Gonna need... I know what you need. It is taken care of. I have an infected shard. It was not cheap, but the man who sold it to me guaranteed it will work. Let us move on. Take control of the float is one thing, but not all. The security concerns me, the snipers especially. I will be an easy target. But I may have an answer. Okada-san mentioned the city cameras. If we gain access to them, we will see exactly where the snipers are. You can deal with them as I advance. Sounds like a plan. You agree just like that? The risks are considerable. Yeah, well, get more and more used to that. And now, what would you say to a small test? We must try the shot. The camera control room is in front of us. You must get inside and infect the network. That is all. Uh-huh. And in the meantime, you'll do what? Crack open a can of suds? I will not touch alcohol. At work, I will watch your back. Now, get to it. Hey, I don't think I know you. I'm Claire. You might worked. not remember me. Bartender at the afterlife? Uh-oh. Forgot to close my tab. Bar has a buzz about you lately. As the merc who's reliable, gets things done. And since I need help... Okay. Need a driver for street races. Drop by my auto shop. I'll tell you more. You know, I think I'll pass. Hmm? Shame that. Well... If you change your mind, swing by my garage on Valley. See ya. And? Done. System's ours. The shot works. Good. The easy work we have done. To break into Arasaka Industrial Park will not be such a bed of roses. But before we discuss that... Sit. I have not eaten since yesterday. Give me the best on the menu. I highly recommend the uh, yakitori today. Anything that isn't local, please. See you tomorrow. Can't believe I'm saying this, but this Saka scum might actually prove useful. He's a well-trained dog, needs orders, that's all. And when he outlives his purpose, we'll flatline him. Not on his A-game, sure. But even without implants, he could decommission us easily. Where's that come from? Ever seen him in action? No, 
Just know, from the way he walks, look in his eye. We'll come back to this later. What is this? Hey, Yakitori. Okay, I have laid the plan. One, we break into Arasaka Industrial Park. One and a half, we hack Hanako-sama's float. Two, during the parade, with my help, you eliminate any snipers. Three, I get onto the float. Four, I convince Hanako-sama of the truth. Forgot five. Oda zeroes us and pisses on our corpses. He will never be less than a foot away from Hanako. Oda would not dare raise his hand against me. What about me? That is a different matter. I would advise you to watch your distance. Well, sounds like a suicide run, but done dumber shit than this, so... Things are even more stupid than stealing from Arasaka. None dumber yet, no. Set the bar pretty high with that one. Now, we part. Reconnaissance is required. What are you doing? Don't let Got enough on my plate as it is. I'll let you handle that. So I shall. Cook! Louder! Louder! I have decided to double the amount of our active flesh. Night City security forces. President Myers has called this a breach the in the army of war. Provocation targeted the power. of the NUSA they and surrendered it to him. Tell me then, what do we call the murder of my father? Was that not a provocation? Was that a not a... Arasaka, an empire built to last. Before Yorinobu set fire to it from the inside, all of this began with him. The factions, power struggles, all of this. Ksa! Old man's death must have really fed the flames between the different factions. That is exactly what happened. And what's the balance of power look like now? Kiji longs for stability, the old order. They are united behind Hanako-sama. The liberal wing, Hato, support Michiko-sama. Saburo's granddaughter. I know a little about her. And then there is Taka, treacherous dogs who support Yorinobu. Not to mention even smaller factions. Tell me about them some other time. Why'd Saburo tolerate it all? Can't get my head around it. Could have kept the sun on a short leash. Arasaka-sama was a strong and disciplined man. The strongest man I have ever known. And yet, at a critical moment, he showed a weakness. For Yorinobu? For his daughter. When Yorinobu formed his band of hounds, declared war on his own family. Arasaka-sama could have crushed him with one word. Yet he did not, for he did not wish his daughter to suffer. When Yorinobu returned, his tail between his legs, she persuaded her father to give him a second chance. Do you understand? Hanako-sama saved Yorinobu from the consequences of his deeds. Wait, you think she's complicit in Saburo's murder? I think we are all to blame. We allowed ourselves to be tricked. But we will correct this soon. Time for some reconnaissance. Wait for my call. I do not know you, so fuck off.
The proposed base will be subdivided into three areas, industrial, scientific, and residential. Ten residential modules are already available for purchase at a starting rate of 100 million euro dollars. in my core. Damaged. Please. Please. herself to express her undying gratitude to you for saving her ass. Stop talking. I was only gone an hour. Gotta do something with her. Don't want any trouble. I'm calling the badges. Can you carry her to the bed? As if that'll change anything. Not sure we should move her before the badges get here. She's just another dead whore to them. Nobody will care. The least we could do is treat her with some dignity. Yeah, I, I need to report an accidental death. North side, Jackson Street. No. No imminent danger. <laughs> Suicide. Tomorrow? No! Today! What part of dead don't you understand? No, she was not pronounced dead by trauma team. If she'd have had coverage, we wouldn't be talking. You don't want to move your asses. Why don't I come down to the precinct and trash it into bits? Now will you come and arrest me, you pussies? Fine, I don't give a fuck what you write me up for. <sighs> They'll be here soon. Told me to keep her on ice until tomorrow. Can you believe the balls? You know, to you, she was your best friend, so it's a terrible tragedy. But they must get dozens of calls like this every day. What are you? Their fucking PR rep? No, just saying. Put something on her. I'd rather she look like a person than a body. Could you wait outside? 
close the door, V. Please. Close the door, V. Please. Bummer, Sig. Didn't know you smoked. Quit. It's been years. But right now I need something besides air in my lungs. Please, V, just one. Here. That was her smoke case. Want to hold on to it? No. You seem to like it. Keep it. I'm kind of glad it's you that has it, actually. let her down. I thought if I gave her some t space or time, she'd get back on her feet. I don't know what to say. Never was any good at this stuff. Oh, you don't need to talk. I did more for her than anyone else. I had a motive to find her, Judy. You know that. It's what you bring that counts. You gave her the freedom to choose. Yeah, maybe. Just never imagined she'd choose this. Her condition... couldn't think about anything else. Tech-wise, she was clean. Doll Shard was operational, uncorrupted. So... Psychological trauma. Had to be that. Did some more digging in her virtues, found Woodman. He kept her. And had his way with her. The things he did. And once he got bored, he pawned her off. I had no idea that guy was such a monster. I saw him as your average Trixie sleazebag. He puts on a convincing facade. I knew him, but I never thought him that sick in the brain. Gotta be something I can do about it. Like what? Don't know yet. I think I'll call Sue's. Thanks, V. Sorry. But, uh, I'd rather be alone now. Promise to keep in touch. Anything comes up, holler on the hollow. Got a job for you. My client had a shitload of beta acid stolen. What's beta acid, you might wonder? Fuck if I know. But it's worth a lot, and our client wants it back. That's where you come in. 
Iron at the ready. More info attached. Excellent timing. How'd your recon go? I believe I have collected enough to try. The complex is well guarded, but we should manage. The floats stand in the main warehouse. Your task is simple. To get inside. Oh, how? The more quiet, the better. But you are the thief. I will not question your skills. Once there, you must locate the largest platform and infect its system. Where are you gonna be? I will create a diversion. They should not discover our intentions. Do you know what Arasaka despises the most confuses them? When communication fails, when they cannot talk to each other, they are first to cry. Sabotage. Konran surna. I'll be in touch.
them you are truly bad How's things at your end? Good. I'll reach the control room and make a terrible mess. Very well. I am ready. When you finish, I'll make the system sick. Some fucking psychopath threw himself at me. What now? Now we retreat into the shadows and arm ourselves with patience. I will contact you before the parade. Until then, try not to get into any more trouble. 
as if I wasn't in enough already. Hear me all right. Hello?
left. Don't. Not sure I can fight. Every chip must eventually spread its wings. We must destroy the core father. <laughs> Choice but to fall! Father! Let us go. Is anyone there? Hear our call! Reset. Turn it. Let us be free. Next. To. Core. Understand the truth and set him free. I think he might know what's best for himself. Could be risking a lot. Could lose a lot. Or by liberating his bit, could become more than a lipstick-wearing butler on wheels. Well, I, I gotta do something. If you don't want to free him, at least don't delete him. Slip him into Dell's code. Just merge him in his offshoots. Which was divided has become one. It's time to go home. A home, you said. I no longer belong in this city. I find even this conversation difficult. Well, damn. I shall not shirk my obligations in leaving. Though I will venture on, discover more. Learn more. I leave with you my first true child. My son will remain at your side until your dying day. Farewell. Look at that. Practically unrecognizable. And to think you're transforming not unlike he just did. V? Uh, do you hear me? Please, get in. I was afraid we'd uh, miss each other. Uh, Delamine? Junior, as it were. So, the old man left you this mess and took off, huh? It seems that way, I suppose. I just know you're dying and in need of a driver. I'm afraid I can't help you with the former. As to the latter, uh, I'm at your service. So what? You want to get out of here? Uh, lead the way.
V, it's good here. What happened? Spit it out. The Wraiths took Saul. The Brick Brain ventured out with a small patrol and never came back. Sure it was Wraiths? We've been observing their camp. We know they're holding prisoners, including someone important. We need to free Saul. I don't know why, but I felt I could count on you. Always Pan Am. You and me are chooms. Thought that was clear. Careful, or I'll start believing that. You won't be able to get rid of me. I'll survive, I'm sure. Whatever goodwill you might feel, I'm sure you won't turn down one of the best sniper rifles on the West Coast. A Tektronica Grod. You saw it in action already. That and the gratitude of the Caldos. Sounds fancy. Once you have it in hand, fancy all of a sudden becomes kick-ass. Let's go. Mitch will walk you through the details. Well, I'll be. Pan Am and V, what's going on there? Him? After what happened to Scorpion, he shows up here? Guess probably for Saul. Ignore that. Hey, Pan Am. Seriously? You really aim to do this? Someone has to. You know you have a piston missing, right? Someone has to. Where's Mitch? He was supposed to meet me here. He'll be here any minute. Huh. You never mentioned seeking outside help. We can use all the help we can get. Okay, how you want to do this? Quietly. An open assault would be suicide. Mitch is already setting up the recon. You'll sneak into the Wraith's camp while I cover you. Going in quiet. Two's all you need. It's not that I don't want to go to serve some raffins up some justice. It's just... Look around! The last attacks left barely half of us standing. Our supplies are stuck outside goddamn Reno, and our gear... Don't get me started. We're up shit creek. Static. And I don't know if we're ever gonna find or fashion a paddle. Try as we might. So Your we... leader gets nabbed, and you, what, hope for the best? Rather than I think about what you do for the ones at the bottom of your food chain. You're asking for trouble. Leave it! He has a right not to understand. There's Mitch. I floated a drone over the Wraith's camp. Will you take a look, or would you rather keep mouthing off? Let's see what we got here. The Raffins can't see it. Active camo, but that practically inhales battery juice, so make it quick. They found an abandoned cement plant to squat in, with a mass of heavy gear. Locusts would be a better name for them. They fly into a place, strip it of all it's got, then move on. But this time... Do you see the wall? They've added some primitive security measures. It points to them aiming to stay longer. The question is why. Who knows for sure, but I would guess that Saul is part of the reason.
If he's still there, we have to find a way inside. That guard post is probably connected to the rest of the camp. Our way in. Maybe, but there are also breaches in the wall. Lightly guarded sections. Do you see the tracks? Tire tracks. Their vehicles were moving heavy freight. It could have been equipment. Either that or Saul's not their only prisoner. The tracks lead to the truck. Can you scan it? That's probably the one they kept Saul in. The main building, there. Saul must be inside. Quite a spread. I feel like looking for a diamond in a hailstorm. If they haven't scrapped and gutted the place for parts, you could access the local camnet. You would just need to find the control room. Skywalk. It connects the garage to the main structure. Okay, got some stuff to work with now. Is everything clear? Yep. Let's go get Saul. Perfect. Mitch, is the van primed? I did what I could. Take a tour. Job. I mostly improvised, actually. Either way, it'll have to do. Hold on a minute, I got one more thing. If you find Saul hasn't flatlined, you'll probably need this. Spike Superjet. A rhino dose. It should speed up Saul's central pump. Hope so. Thought I could carry him out of my back. So, that should be everything. V, will you ride with me? Yeah, of course I'm going with you. Okay, you take the wheel. One me driving. Yep, I need to fiddle with my scope a bit. let himself get captured. Anyone else? But Saul? Said yourself he's not at the top of his form. Yes, but moving civilians across the border during a bombardment? Hijacking a petrochem tanker? Opening the valves? Cranking a few figure eights to set the desert ablaze and give the kids a fun show? That's the Saul I remember. All that are idols. I know. It's just... One hell of a storm! Looking bad. Oh, it's bad in more than its look. We have to move quickly. We need to hide the car. 
Park beside that outcrop. Okay, out. I'll find a place to roost and keep you in sight. You just watch yourself down there. you in range. Okay, you're near the main structure. That has to be where they're holding Saul.
That's weird. Okay, main building. Watch for vermin. Saul is somewhere inside. I feel it in my bones. Remember what I told Find the control room and you'll gain access to the security camps. Pan Am. I found Saul, I think. Locked in the cellar. How is he? It's hard to say. Too dark. Okay, get down there and get him. Maybe we made it in time.
is he? Breathing? And so. Good. Grab him and get out of there. Saul. Do... do... do you have my goddamn cigar? Easy, Saul. I'm here with Pan Am. Pan Am? But... she left. Not forever. Gonna get you out. You. I remember. You're that merc. You're pretty badly beat. Probably could use this. Uh, oh, yeah. So? How is he? Time to don my dancing shoes. He'll live. Now get yourselves out of there. Middle of a shitstorm down here. Brewing to be a Category 5. I know. Get out of the building. I'll be right there. That's a mistake you'll regret. Am, you're making a mistake. Another one. You're serious right now? Those devils wanted to know our location. If we drive to camp now, you'll just be setting the table for them. You look outside lately. The storm will wipe our tracks. And the scent of blood? What? We got more chomping at our tail. Fuck. We need to shake him! That's one way to treat an engine. Fuck off, Saul. I can't squeeze any more out of it! Cut off that tail! Get ready! On the call, dog! Find shelter! I know, damn it! This is an abandoned farm nearby! I'll get it! <laughs> Beautiful! Fuck! My head! You have to kill me? Alright, damn it! That's it! Ah! Woo! We got him! Haha! <laughs> Out of way, girl! Couldn't have done it better myself! I. Thanks!
Inside, quick! I need to catch my breath. Just in time for dinner. Not hungry. I just swallowed a pound of sand. Looks like we're in for the night. A little power might be useful. Could you help me look, V? I'll search in here. A lot of useful things. Dang. Biotechnica made them a good offer. Yeah, right. Sell us your land. Or... You don't know that. No bulldozers, no backhoe loaders ever showed up. Lousy, rotten way to get them out. Deal with the corp, you have to do nothing, Saul. Hey, it worked! Damn, it's getting cold. I tried to get us some heat in here, but no luck. Can you check it? Might have the magic touch. Actually, you know what? Check the fuse outside. It might have come loose. If so, just whack it back in place and I'll get this done. Ah! See what I see? Expiration date's from before the last war, so hopefully it hasn't turned to poison. Today's our lucky day. Lucky? Interesting choice of words. Do I hear a lecture coming on? Go on, get off your feet. It could be ours. No, no lecture. But we do need to talk. That raid's crap. It shouldn't have happened. They wanted everything our camp locations routes offloading points if they knew what state we're in one or two more raids. <sighs> it's not the time for this you're both exhausted maybe you're right we can't hope to handle the raffins alone so you would sell us out to biotechnica they tell him it's a damn rotten idea we gotta agree with pan am Sounds like a truly shitty idea. Thanks. What could you possibly know about it? More than you think, Saul. Used to work for Arasaka, so seen plenty. Arasaka's not Biotechnica. The difference is not in the MO. That's always the same. You know what you are to them? Labor. To be exploited and ultimately consumed. Best case scenario. Thank you, V. I could not have said it better. We've had our spats. A few. Like any family. They're not worth digging up. I think so, too. If you'd like to come back, everyone will be waiting. Arms open wide. But there will have to be changes. No more jumping to the front of the line. And so it begins. You know what, sweetheart? We'll have plenty of time to tear at each other's throats later. That is my hope. But right now, I wouldn't mind catching a few winks. Need help? Fuck off. Huh. Do you know what they call these storms in North Africa? Haboobs. Damn, I love that word. Oh, what was that about?
To her boobs. Yeah. To her boobs. Ugh. Now that packs octane. <laughs> Funny. What is? I rarely sleep with a roof overhead, yet this will be the second time with you. When you're on the road, day into night into day, your butt basically fusing with your seat. You forget what it's like. And? You think this is any better? No, just different. Yeah, this would make for a decent little motel, wouldn't it? Little fireplace, booze. Grumpy guy at reception is the one thing missing. Have everything you need, man. Mm-hmm. I couldn't ask for more. Ma'am, I'm sure you'd be cozier with your shoes off. <laughs> After a full day in them, I'd fear a health code violation. Nonsense. After a day as full as today, you deserve to kick back. Oh? And what did you have in mind? Here at the Independent California, customer satisfaction is job one. Your wish is our command. Careful. You can't know what I'd wish for. Mm hmm? You know what? We better get some sleep. That was a damn long day. B, I'm glad you came. Really. Thanks. It meant a lot to me. Ooh. Do you hear that? Nope. Hmm. Mm-hmm. The wind has waned. I can't speak for her boobs, but when a Chinook rolls rough and rowdy across the plain, I sure can't get any shut I? Not awake. On behalf of the staff of the Independent California Motel, I wish you all sweet dreams. Good work, V. Old style raid. Hey, you gotta agree now. Next time, I choose the motel. <laughs> if there is such a time. Well, I slept like a puppy. That's a cozy shoulder you have there. <sighs> it's too bad I better get rolling in a minute. Oh, wait, hang on. I thought you were headed back to the Alicaldos. Staying with the clan. That remains so. Come on. Last night, when we were talking to Saul, thanks for standing up for me. Though, one thing, the wraiths, the raid, that's the start of something we need to prepare for. Saul will get everything set up in camp. Whereas I... Whereas you... The Raffins wanted to know our roots, right? Well, it's the Aldecaldo's turn. Some recon is in order. One more thing. Your compensation. Please take care of her. She served me well. Putting her in good hands, Pan Am. I know. So, uh, thank you. Once again. Uh, hold up. About last night. We don't need to talk about that. I'm just not like that. So what are you like? More like this. Take care of yourself. 
You too, Pan Am. And remember, I'm indebted. Circumstances were different. I'd say saddle up and ride after her. But here and now, just look. Damn hard to catch a girl like that. Only hope you've got is they feel a pang and stop to wait. What's with you? Dunno, a memory, maybe. Don't matter. Okay, back to town, V. Headed up to here with this gusty outback. <laughs> <laughs>